I'm Jim Craig, Superintendent of Southern Wells Community Schools. Southern Wells will pursue an operating fund referendum this fall. What is an operating fund referendum? Why do we need one? And what will it cost? First, an operating referendum gives the community an opportunity to do something extra for the schools. It provides an extra amount of funding when the community feels a specific educational initiative needs to be addressed. Operating fund referendums by law are limited to seven years in length. In Southern Wells' case, our educational initiative is to try to keep our class sizes at a reasonable level, refrain from cutting more programming and staff, and implement full-day kindergarten. Research is clear. All children benefit from a small class size. In fact, it is a keystone for effective teaching and learning and ensuring educational excellence. Our recent ISTEP scores reflect the advantages of our present class structure. Also, students who participate in organized and complete kindergarten program have a much stronger foundation and better chance to succeed in the educational system. And finally, at this time of higher standards and greater expectations, we need to be enhancing our curricular offerings, not inhibiting student achievement by cutting programming. Last spring, we reduced programs and staff and froze salaries, but this is not enough. To keep class sizes where they are today, provide full-day kindergarten, and sustain our present curricular offerings, we need to raise about $300,000 a year. Taking into consideration homestead credits, circuit breaker amounts, and gross property tax, is estimated the additional cost on a home with $100,000 of assessed value would be about $61 per year. If the referendum should fail, we will need to make additional budget cuts and reduce our teaching staff by three or four positions. Elementary class sizes could increase from an average of 22 to over 30 junior high and secondary course offerings will be reduced or consolidated, which will dilute the content and provide less preparation for positive comprehensive test outcomes and seriously impact the ability of the school system to prepare our students to be competitive in today's culture. We are asking the community to vote on Tuesday, November 3rd. Polls will be open from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. You vote at the same site you would vote in a general or primary election. All registered voters are eligible to vote. Only one item will be on the ballot. Please vote yes to support the approval of an operating referendum for Southern Wells Schools. If the referendum is successful, Southern Wells Schools will be able to continue its current philosophy of offering a varied and progressive curriculum with manageable class sizes. We also could finally start full day kindergarten and give our young students the opportunities that 90% of the school children throughout the state already enjoy. A simple majority of those who vote will determine the outcome. Our children's future is in your hands. If you have any questions, I will be happy to visit with you. My contact information is on the Southern Well Schools website. Thank you.